Well, the gift shop is part of the uh, Legislative Assembly Office uh, Visitor Center, and uh, it is intended to showcase uh, Alberta crafts, uh, works of art, and, and books, and uh, to complement uh, programming that the uh, Visitor Center is uh, producing. For example, we, have te we will have temporary exhibits in a temporary exhibit space, turning over four times a year, and some of the merchandise that we will sell here will, will be as an adjunct to that temporary exhibit. Starting in November, we're having one of the copies of the Magna Carta on display for a month, so some of the, the giftware that we will have there will support that uh, particular exhibition in rather the same way that museum gift shops operate. The money we make goes to offset the cost of operation here and, and our other public education outreach programming. The number of, of outreach programs that we run uh, you know, vary uh, from programs that are aimed at uh, grade six students right across to, to seniors. So we've got programs for English language learners, high school students, for university students. It's used in a variety of different ways. You know, we have a number of different mediums on display here. So we start with, uh, with, with books, we move to ceramics, we have glassware, we have jewelry, we have a 2D, uh, different type of fabric, as well as paintings and photographs. So we try and cover as much as people would want to find in a, in a shop like this, and different price points as well. So people can walk in and buy smaller gift items right up to you know a few thousand dollars for larger glassworks. I don't think there's any theme per se so much as it's about the expression of Alberta artists. So we look at fine craft and fine art, and we look at artists who get their inspiration from where they live in Alberta. As much as possible, we try and get them from Canadian manufacturers, Alberta first, Canadian second and there's very few items that are done offshore. We have you know two and a half times the size of space so we've been actually working for the last six months going around the province talking to different artists and then having them come here look at the space and seeing you know what they would like to display here.